Hey, what's up guys? It's Nash and welcome to my channel for another daily in Palea. That's right, we're back for another episode. Oh man, okay, my inventory's full because I have been prepping my gifts for the villagers. E yeah. Okay, I have beyond a crazy amount of seeds and and onions, so I'm going to actually just sell all these onions. Boom, boom, boom. And then how many tomatoes do I have? I have 19. I'm going to pretty much... I'm going to put one away and then we are going to sell the rest. Not the seeds though. I want to keep those to replant. But everything else is going to be sold. And I'm going to keep trying to harvest as much as I can today. Oh my gosh. Uh, 1,500. Oh jeez, I just blasted through that. 1,500 crops harvested. That's crazy. So that's going to net us uh, an extra 4,000. That's pretty amazing. Now, did I need a tomato? I did need one tomato for a gift today. So we're going to be giving that. And then I feel like there was something else missing here. But I can't remember. Anyways, we're today is going to be, like I said, a huge gifting day. This new watering can, though, is a absolute blessing. I love it so much. I don't even have to move around anymore to get all my crops watered. So I technically also already changed my outfit for today, but I'm going to change it again because I got some really cool stuff unlocked thanks to you guys. You guys have been using my referral code down in the comment section below and we unlocked a couple of things. So finding friends set, I unlocked this cute choppa sweater. We already had the hat unlocked, but you guys have been using my code, which makes me so excited and happy. So today we're gonna go, I think this is the Finding Friends one. Yeah, this is the full Choppa set, the Choppa outfit. You can get it in blue too. Actually, the blue is super cute. Normally I was feeling kind of orange today, but I think, were we orange in the last episode? Maybe, maybe we do the full blue Choppa pajama set. It's not really a pajama set, but it's like a hoodie. It's kind of, is it kind of cute? <laughs> I don't know. I feel like I like the orange set better, but I like the blue pants. Maybe hold on. Let's go. Let's go change it one more time because I really like the orange and I didn't even look at the this set like this color in it. Maybe maybe that. No, I would have loved this if it came in green. That would be so cute. But I think what I want to do is the orange set. I was feeling orange today, so I think we're yeah, I like the orange set. But I think I have, oh, there was one more thing. I was going to say, but I have everything in my inventory. But there's something I want to show you guys. You guys also unlocked this for me, which is so cute. It's two Choppa plushies hugging. And I can't even believe it. It's the cutest stinking thing in my life. And I want to put it on this bench. Can I not put it on the bench? Oh, no. I wanted to have them, like, sitting there hugging each other, being all cute and stuff. I could put this over here in the corner, maybe. That could be cute. Or maybe my, my house needs to entirely redecorated, that's for sure. My bedroom's probably a good place for this. Let's, uh, let's put it right there. That is so cute. Thank you guys so much. Now, again, I don't get anything from you guys using my referral code besides these in-game items, these like little cosmetic in-game items. I don't get paid. I don't get sponsored. I don't get anything from it except for just cosmetics, which, hey, I will take cosmetics in a game. I think it's so fun and cute. But thank you guys so much. It really does mean a lot to me. So thank you. All right, we're going to go around and hopefully find some of the people that I'm looking for. Ashura being the first one. Now, I mentioned this before, I want Ashura to be my Shep, so I am going to be gifting him. I wish I could give him his loved gifts weekly wants, but I can't. He does want one of these juniper seeds, so I had one of those. I'll get to planting and help this regenerates the forest. You always have to give back what you get after all. My knee's feeling a bit better today. I was able to work all around the Crystal Lake. If you can believe it, hey, I'm super glad to hear it. So, out of curiosity, what level are we at now? Ah, oh, we're only halfway. Oh my word. I thought this process would be so fast and it's just, it's not. It takes time. It definitely takes time. Is there anyone else at the inn that we can talk to? Sometimes there's people hanging out, but 
It does not look like it, so we're just going to kind of make our rounds in circles and see if we can find people. There are a couple gifts that I do need to go out and still get, such as Ruth's gift and Ani's gift. So I've already seen those two, and I have not been able to gift them anything. It's still very early in the morning, so it's like no one's around. Everyone's at home or sleeping. I bet you Einar is around though, so I'm going to go see if he's at the dock. Also, again, super sorry if today's video, just like that, is super stuttery. Um, I don't know. Some days the game is so stuttery for me, and then other days it's completely fine. <laughs> All right, yes. Jell, I believe I hopefully have a gift for you. No, I was supposed to find him moth. Dang it. Okay. Uh, there's it's, it's always the people I find that I don't have gifts for at that point in time. So it looks like Einar is at the dock. This is going to be my only loved want that we're going to be giving today, I believe. And he wants glow worms. So thanks many for the fish nutrients. I shall use this to lure in the most beautiful, many beautiful gills. <laughs> Your kind called my kind, the Galders. We have another name, but you wouldn't be able to pronounce it. I wouldn't. Why? Why not? Its syllables are only understandable in the language of flow. Waiting to engage in a conversation oh my god, I love when he squats like that. <laughs> okay, so it is 6 a.m. There's actually one thing that I needed to go get for Reth that I left at the house. So I'm going to do that super quickly. We're going to go back to the house and do a little cooking. Four thousand gold. What does that put me at for the market? 10k? Ah, it's my first 10k guys like in in the bank like that actually no because i i bought the big house extension and i think that was 10k so it's my second 10k i think that's gonna be great for the market very cool okay that makes me super happy uh i gotta water my crops that's partially why i wanted to come back because i do need to do a little bit of my chores but i also need to make a creamy carrot soup for Reth, which is i think is that one of his no it's not one of his look oh wait we might be able to make loaded potato soup that is one of his loved gifts let me go see if i can cook up some loaded potato soup now some of these recipes get a little bit crazy look how much we've unlocked this is feeling so good look at how like intense this recipe is so we need to make chopped meat onions and garlic we need to make bacon in the oven and then we've got to stir twice so i think we've got this um let's come over here and let's get everything chopped we'll do the onions first we'll do the bacon last because that cooks pretty pretty quickly if I can get this on the first try, that would be fantastic, beautiful. Okay, let's do the garlic next. And then we're gonna have to go stir in just a second. Focus, Nash, focus. Don't lose this one, beautiful. Okay, yeah, we need to go stir this. And then we should be good to go. Awesome, we can add our two ingredients here. And we just need to chop up a little bit of bacon. I'm gonna use some Cernuk meat because that's what I tend to have the most of usually since I hunt quite a bit. It is my only skill at level 10. Dang, that's my first fail. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. Dang it. <laughs> Saying dang it helps. All right, let's bake this, make it into bacon. Now we just wait. I said this was hard. Nah, this is gonna be easy, easy, easy. Loaded baked potato soup, hopefully for my sometime boyfriend maybe <laughs> oh i want wrath i want to romance wrath but like I'm, i don't think i'm at the point yet where i can romance him so we'll see anyways here's his uh his food for the day and it's star quality okay i wonder if that'll get us a little extra points it is the beautiful daytime which means that i think we'll be able to find everybody that we're looking for hopefully we can at least go into calorie i believe i have what i need for calorie hopefully mean? Yes, so Calorie wanted a little bit of weed. <laughs> like, quite literally, she wanted some weed. So, uh, some snapweed, I think is what it's called. Napweed. No, napweed. Uh, Eloisa and I were literally, we would spend hours at the beach. She always used to search for fragments of shipwrecks. Said they were all reminded uh, remnants of Grimalkin spaceships in disguise. Interesting. Okay, so you wanted a little Aww. weed. Many thanks. 
I apologize if you don't like the picture on your library card, but sadly I must insist there are no retakes. I mean, I, I guess I do have a library card. I forgot that I got that way back in the day, but yeah, I did. So Anya wants a bug, which I need to go catch a little bit later today. It looks like Tish is actually not in here. So Kenyatta wanted a little bit of leather, so we're gonna give that on over. Thanks. I didn't know you were paying attention to this kind of things I like. Not a lot of people take the time to do that. You know, you're probably one of the only cool people that drops by City Hall. I mean, most people just want to look at the old records or get permits for things. Like, come on, total snooze fest. <laughs> Alright, let's go see if anyone's upstairs, like Eshi or Kenley. Eshi is upstairs. I think I have... <laughs> your case. I think I have your, your daily want, Eshi. Yes, so she also wanted leather, which I find interesting. Like mother, like daughter. I'll take this to Bahari. I'm sure my personal tailor can do something with it. Who's your Who's your tailor in Bahari? Is Bahari a different place than Bahari Bay? Is there like a, a bigger Bahari? There probably is, and I just haven't been paying attention. <laughs> is Reth here? Reth is here. Beautiful. Okay, nothing better than a meal made by Chef Reth himself. Am I right or am I right? Hey, try this on for size. Some loaded potato soup. Wow, soup. Loaded potato soup is my favorite too. So, I mean, hey, we can eat that together and get along. Is it a food? Is it a drink? No one knows. Hey, friend in need. Look at that. Wait, does that mean I'm level three relationship now? But either way, I'm a big fan. More right now. Oh. I have a... Wait I'll a second. I have a talk. quest. Wait, can I start romancing at level three or is it level four? You're here. I mean, uh, hey there. There's only nothing... Nothing disastrous happening right now i've got everything handled that being said i may have the world's weirdest favor to ask mm -hmm. after you covered me last time i figured i should put a little more effort into my job with ashura i have to fund my love my fund my lavish lifestyle after all but uh i've also got a side job you're overworking yourself or i respect the hustle you're overworking yourself mm -hmm. no it's fine i'm fine I get at least an hour of sleep every night. I'm doing great, sweet tooth. But that is where you come in. I run a little delivery service on the side. One of my clients is waiting for her package. I know that you I know what you're thinking. Why didn't I just pick it up after I'm done here? Well, I uh uh cake. What? It's a uh, cake and it's just sitting there in the elements, getting staler by the minute. It's a cake. It's a cake. Just a cake. <laughs> Seems totally on the level, or dot dot dot. Ah, uh, fine, this last time, or only because it's hmm. you. Thanks, Nash. You're really saving my bacons here. Look, we are level three. Oh my word. Okay, uh, so the drop point should be by the eastern docks, next to the bucket that looks like a frog. Just grab it and deliver it to Tamala in Bahari Bay. Interesting. You know, I'm gonna assume you're spending all this time with me just because you like my company because you're angling for anything else uh what does that mean <laughs> making the other assumption has gotten me in trouble in the past oh. oh but you know if you wanted to flirt with me or bring me some heart drop lilies i'd be open to it just saying Man, ah. i need to catch a quick oh now. my gosh wait a second i'm so Blank stoked okay um so Mm, oh, okay, hold on. Uh, I think I hear I'm so excited. Wait, so this can I romance him? Can I romance Red now? Because this is what I've been waiting for. Fire wakes. Tish also. Oh, she just hit level three too. What the heck? Oh my gosh. Red is level three. Give a romantic gift to this villager. To you. Oh my gosh, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. So I think if I give them. Wait, he said sun drop lilies, but. I wonder, like, because I heard you got to give them a box of chocolates. Um, so I'm going to go buy one since we have so much money. Rolling in the money bags, $200 for a box of chocolates. Rathy, you better like me. This holy smokestack. That's a lot of money. But I'm, I'm, I'm intrigued. I'm so excited. Talking I'm romancing Rath. Ah! Okay, what's up? Oh, I can't give him a gift today. Dang it, I have to do it tomorrow. That sucks. No! Go. All right, well, I have them for tomorrow. I do not have... Oh, wait, did Elo Eloisa want a chip fragments? And I do have this wagon wheel. Oh, a gift. I assume some sort of hidden meaning. I cannot wait to figure it out. I've been thinking about the specimen you gave me. If everyone could see them, maybe it would 
uh, they would believe in our investigations. We need a space dedicated to mystery, perhaps a shack of some sort. If only someone opened something like that. Uh, do you really think people would like that? The Academy would be mad. I really need somewhere to put my bugs. I bet Calorie would help you. People like museums and mystery. Heck yeah. A museum? That would be perfect. Perhaps I would consider this further. <gasps> if Eloisa ever opened a museum, I would die. Where we could put all of our oh, bugs and stuff. I would be so excited. Mm. Uh, good to see you around the farm again. If you ever need gardening or workout tips, I'm your guy. I don't need those, but I do need to give you a gift today because I want to get my friendships up with everybody, including you. He Surprise. also wanted a wagon wheel. One person's trash is another person's treasure, right? I can fix this right up. Always good to have a few spare wheels around the farm. Time Beautiful. Really flew by. There she is. She's walking right into the furniture shop. Hey, Dish. What's it's up, really girl? I know this may sound a little extreme, but things are so less than optimal today. I'm trying to look on the bright side, but it is just extremely difficult right now, especially given the fact that I'm so busy with commissions. I don't even have time to rage redecorate like I normally do, and when I'm feeling a little bit miffed, that is always the best. Have you guys ever redecorated your room at like 3 in the morning? Because that's... that's... that's fun. <laughs> Can I ask why you're feeling upset? I want to help. Rage redecoration? That sounds rad. I, I really like that one, but I kind of want to see what she's upset about. Oh, it's nothing. I don't want to bother you with my feelings, but maybe you could help me with something else. Why don't you help me with some new with a new piece? I've got this new set that I've been noodling on. Maybe you can take a crack at trying to build me something for it. Uh, it'll be a win-win. I'll get the furniture and you'll get the practice of your skill. Yeah, for sure. That sounds awesome. Okay, so what did Tish want? She wanted clay. Oh, wow. I've been window shopping for something like this for months. You just pick it off the ground. Don't shop for this stuff. It's it's free. How are you doing today? Great, frustrated, or I've been better. I'm doing great today. I like your optimism. I don't know if I've told you this yet, but growing up, I was really sick. My parents didn't think I'd make it this far, but when you treat every day as a gift, well, I guess the world has a way of giving back. Oh, this episode's full of love. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. So I'm supposed to craft something. I guess we'll figure that out. All right. We need to try to find uh, a Hossian, I believe. And we need to find Sifu. Hossian's over here, which is good. Hadari. We need to go to Bahari Bay. There's there's several things we've got to get done. But Hossian, I think I have a gift for you, hopefully. I do. So Hossian wanted some cotton, which I got on me. Surprisingly useful. I appreciate the thought. Admiring my bow, are you? My mother made the finest blades and bows this side of Kilima's mountains. I'm lucky that what she lacks in maternal instinct, she makes for up for in professional that talents. Interesting. interesting, interesting. Oh my god, we are not wearing the same outfit. Oh. Oh, yes. Boo, dude, let's go. First of all, sick name, but also, look, heck yeah. That has never happened to me in the game before, but this is this is a very like matching set, so it kind of makes sense. Anyways, uh, I'm gonna head over to go see Tamala, as well as Hadari and uh, Najuma. Okay, actually changing my mind just a wee bit. We're gonna stay in town. I'm gonna go over there later because there's a couple. I need to collect two moths, and I need to wait till nighttime to do that. And it doesn't make sense to go over there now when I could just do that at nighttime. So I still need to find Kenley. I need to find Hecla and Gina. And I need to find, well, Sifu. Uh, I don't have anything to give to Zeki. I'll try to get him something, but his wants are kind of interesting. So, hey, wait, Hodari. Hodari, you're here in town, what the heck? Okay, so Hadari wanted a copper bar. I got that for you. I think this should help me with those supports up on the two shakes. Help me get those supports up in two shakes of an Ormu's tail. So, Shane, are you up here, my friend? You are. Beautiful, beautiful. So, Shane wanted a little bit of napweed as well. I am honored with your generosity. If you wish to be your respects to the ancestors of the village, you can find the shrines of the Remembrance Garden. Unlike many other creatures, Majiri do not actually bury our dead. Families are newly departed. Go on the sacred pil pilgrimage to a wellspring where you can return their loved ones on the birthplace of once to the birthplace me. of flow nice 
I don't know why, but wearing this outfit makes me feel like I would get so hot and sweaty in it. Like, it's just such a beautiful day, and I feel like I would be so sweaty and hot in this, like, big sweater and these big boots and big pants. Alright, this is where we gotta pull out the trusty, trusty, dusty map. <laughs> oh, Paul Drew's walking right here. Okay, and Kenley is also at the office. Where's Miss Delilah? Delilah. Einar. Oh, yeah, I have to go pick up something over there, right? By the dock. A drooby dooby doo. I got a gift Let for you. Do our best. Um, can I give you. What did you want? <laughs> hey, he would like a tomato plant seed, which crud didn't bring. <laughs> Crap. <laughs> All right, I have a uh -huh. sweet remedy for this. Hold on. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Badru, I will get you what you want. I need to buy something from Zeki anyway today so I can get my coin. A Zeki coin. I do come back every single day for a Zeki coin. At least I try to. All right, I'm going to spend $80 on the tomato seed for Badrooby Dooby Doo. Today's your lucky day. You got some $80 tomato seeds. Hey, notes of friendship. We got to level up. Depending on whether these seeds are the fruits or vegetables or something else entirely. Do you have a quest for me? Yes. I'm a questing fiend, guys. Mm, blue rose, potatoes, no, no, cornflower spring shower oh hey if it isn't my number one benefactor i was just working on a little ditty while i worked uh best way to pass the time it's not like i was secretly trying to compose my magnum opus or anything but would be just but that would just be silly i'd love to hear it i thought you weren't going to play anymore i'd love to hear it who me play a song right here where everyone could walk up yeah, we are kind of in the in the tavern. I'm not sure I'm ready for all that yet. Boy, is it just me or did the sun suddenly get hotter? No, it's hot today. Uh, because I'm sweating like an ormu in a sweater. Or worse, Nio after a run. <laughs> Ooh. Anyways, uh, tell you what. Stop by the barn later tonight and I'll be happy to give you a one-man show. Interesting. Um, maybe you can help me figure out the rest of the lyrics. Don't worry, I'll be there. Or will there be snacks? Don't worry, I'll be there. Great, I'll see you tonight. Uh, Music to, to my ears. Alright, I need Sifu. Sifu, are you here? Yes! Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful Sifu. What would you like? So Sifu wanted just a standard uh. arrow. I was just running low on these. Good timing like always. Now I wonder what kind of beasties I can take down Next with it. Time you slay a monster, I've got oh the yeah, best metal you'll find. Slay a monster Sifu style. Nice to see you out enjoying life in Kilima. Wait, so I only have one wagon wheel left, and I was gonna give Gino a wagon wheel, so I guess I... I guess I miss... I miscounted. A bit embarrassed to admit, I sampled one of your tomatoes before I sent it to my sister. It had the perfect mixture of tangy and umami flavors that made my taste buds absolutely dance. Hey, my tomatoes are the best. Hecla, hecla, hecla. I have a gift for you. Would you like some ramen? This shall make a delicious treat for my Gina. Many thanks, academic associates. There we go. Do you have a quest? Yes! Questing like a mad woman, questing like a mad woman. This is why I love giving gifts, because you get quests. Hello, human. I see that many of my Pelians, including Gina, have come to count on you for a completion, the completion of tasks. While my experience would suggest that humans can't be trusted, I have to admit that your behavior has provided some evidence to the contrary. At least in your unique instance. Can I trust you to bring me some supplies? Yes, I'm always willing to help. Good, I'm in need of procuring a scrap of fabric, two buttons, and a potato. Where do I get buttons? Oh, Delilah! Delilah, you were in Zeki's? Anything of course you were in Zeki's. Zeki, I don't want to talk to you. Take it easy. Damn, Delilah, I need, I, girl, I need to talk to you. Alright, so we need to give her some Hydro Pro Fertilizer. That is this stuff. Fertilizer, I bet on I bet our next crops will come out even better than last year's, thanks to ye. Oh, hello. Mm. 
so we just got the buttons that we needed from Joe, which is awesome because I was kind of curious. I was like, wait, buttons? It only makes sense that we would get them from Joe. And now I caught a silvery minnow for Zeki. I wasn't originally going to gift him anything, but his, his easier gifts are, are actually quite easy. Just got to do a little bit of fishing this week. And yeah, so we're going to go to the underground layer to deliver the, the minnow. The minnow, yeah. <laughs> Zeki! I thought Zeki hung out down here. Oh man, well, we can look at stuff. Oh my god. I want this so bad for my kitchen as like a fridge. Oh, I love all the rugs. I really need rugs. Okay, I thought Zeki would be here. Where would Zeki be? All right, it looks like we're gonna have to do that tomorrow. So it's basically just Zeki and Ani. Those are the two gifts that I have to give. So yeah, we have a quest marker up here. I think this is where the cake is because he said it would be by the dock or something and then we have to take it to tamala so that's gonna be the plan but we had to find the cake first why would you hide cake near a dock this didn't make any sense to me i'm a bit curious uh curious by this that's for sure um okay where would off the second pier he said something, something by the frog thing i bet it's in here oh wait there it is oh my gosh the cake yeah the frog thing okay that opens it's so cute Okay, fun, fun, fun. Right, Miss Tamala is finally awake. Surprise. I can deliver some cake. I have a delivery for you. Well, well, aren't you? Uh, you weren't who I was expecting. Pick up some odd jobs from Zeki, hmm? I'm doing Ruth a favor. Oh. What a good friend you are. Why, well, I could use a helpful, discreet friend like you too. I can think of so many uses for you. Here's your cake. <laughs> yes, thank you for my cake. Of course, I ordered this cake ages ago, but I suppose I'm not paying Zeki for speed. It helps that he sent such a cute delivery person this time, though. You'll have to stop by later and share some of this cake with me. What, a, what, a sh what actually is it? It gets so lonely out here after all. Is she flirting with me? I feel like I'm being flirted with. <laughs> you can go now. Alright, I guess I need to uh, report back to Reth. I also need to go talk to Badru. I need to head back home. So I think that's what I'm going to do is actually just fast travel back to my plot, my home plot, go grab what I need, and then we'll go talk to Reth and Gina. Um, okay, let's put off uh, some of this stuff away. And then I need to grab a potato, which I'm running low on actually. And then a little bit of fabric. Please tell me I have fabric. We should probably filter this into materials. There we go. Yes, I do have fabric. Okay, beautiful. I think that's all that I needed, correct? And then we need to give Zeki his fish. Yes, talk to Bedru in the barn. Hecla, Reth. Okay, we're good to go. I do need to... Oh, we got another harvest. All right, so we're going to have another little big stack of money coming in here, which will be amazing. So we're going to sell all of those and then keep those so three thousand just from that my goodness that's crazy kill them a night moth i don't need any of those so i think i have about two more harvests on these maybe just one i'm not quite sure uh before i'm out of these tomatoes and need to replant them all right first person i'm bringing over to see is red for me or my ah, what brings you over to the my neck of the village i made your delivery <sighs> Shh, keep your voice down. I don't want to share to find out I've been working side jobs. Mm. I'll try to give me a speech about pacing myself and the importance of taking breaks. That wasn't a cake. Tamala mentioned Zeki or it's important to take breaks. All of these are things I would want to say. Tamala mentioned Zeki though. She what? Uh, I figured she, uh, she'd have a little discretion. Look, there are too many prying ears around here. Meet me in the storeroom below the inn, okay? storeroom below the inn use this key to unlock the door i promise i'll tell you everything then and make sure no one sees break you from my charming smile the store okay oh wait okay below the inn we're we're in the inn so i would assume it's down here oh my gosh this is so cool i know this is where we're meant to be so it looks like we got to go through this door. Oh, we're going on a secret quest. Reth's storeroom. Oh, I've never been in here. I've never even seen this. Ah. 
Oh my gosh, this is so cool. There's a recipe here. Oh, I'm excited. Okay, Reth, I want to talk together? to you. Okay, uh, there you are. Uh, no one saw you come in, right? No one? Yes, I loudly announced it to everyone. Uh, I wouldn't do that to you. Mm. No, I guess you wouldn't. Hmm. So, right, I said I'd explain everything. Oh man, I really shouldn't though. I could get in some really hot water. It's okay, Reth, you don't have to say. You can trust me or you promised me. You can say, you can trust me. That's the thing. I feel like I can trust you, which is weird. Because if you haven't noticed, I have trust issues. <laughs> kind of comes with the territory, I guess. That wasn't a cake. It was a flow-powered device. And using flow as a Maji in Palea is illegal. Like, really illegal. Like, summoning up watchers from the city to arrest everyone in sight kind of illegal. Doesn't matter what kind, uh, kind it is either. Even the stuff that doesn't hurt anyone. Even the stuff that could maybe save someone's life. So you're a criminal, or that's all? That's all? Uh, I guess, yeah, that's all. Not like I didn't just spill my guts to you and put my fate in your hands or anything. To be honest, I kind of thought you'd take this harder. And here I am, getting all worked up over nothing. Hey, it happens. Sometimes it happens. It's easy to overthink. Uh, I promise, whatever I'm delivered for Zaki isn't dangerous. I, I wouldn't have gotten you tangled up in this either. But as she's been keeping a closer eye on me lately, I don't think she knows anything, but I'd rather not risk it. So are we good? Next time, be honest. We're good. Or no, we're not. We're good. Good. That's good. I don't want to be all sappy, but you're a pretty good friend. I don't want to ruin what we've got, you know? I don't either. <laughs> Piece of cake. I promise I'll only lie for fun in the future, not profit. Uh, what's in that, that locked box? I don't know. And I don't want to know. Zeki told me if I tried to pick the lock, I'd have to figure out how to do my job one-handed. As it turns out, I kind of attached to both my hands, so uh, I've left it alone. Doesn't sound worth it. I'm not scared of Zeki or who needs hand. <laughs> I'd rather know it's in the box. Um, I'm not scared of Zeki. Well, if you want to look for the key, it might be a challenge. Uh, Zeki said he hid it where no man can survive, whatever that means. You know, you might be the first person in the village I I've actually considered a friend. I mean, as sure as my boss, Tish is my sister. So that brings my previous friend's total to, let's see, carry the one, multiply by a X. Uh, just what I thought, a whopping zero. I guess I've just always had a hard time opening up to people. I mean, trusting people with what I've trusted you with. It's kind of a big burden to put on Gotta anybody. Go. Tish needs me. Okay, so yeah, this is the lockbox. You need to find a small key. Hidden where no man would survive? Is there anything else here? Yeah, look at this freezer. Okay, here's a recipe for the tomato soup, the cream of tomato soup. This is actually one of, uh, this is one of his wanted gifts this week. Like, literally, one of Reth's wanted gifts is creamy, oh no, it's creamy carrot soup. This is tomato soup. My bad, never mind. <laughs> Not as popular as soggy lettuce, tomato soup is making a comeback on the savory soup scene just make mix equal parts tomato chopped onions and butter to the perfect creamy co uh concoction for the perfect creamy and butter to perfect the cream the i can't read that whatever <laughs> the best results serve with a baguette on the side this is such a cool place okay let's return to the village probably not gonna find the key to the box today just because i genuinely have no idea where to look for that and we've already done so much today but i definitely want to do that in a future episode because that intrigues me a lot what could be in zeki's locked box hey hecla i got some stuff for you oh gina's here too nice many thanks for the pro uh procurement of these items here some sustenance as thanks Please think of me as it passes through your digestive system. Uh, have you yet found the vault where I was first awakened? It is just over the hill there. My master's things are no longer in the area. Well, besides me. I suppose I am still one of her things, even though she is no longer living. She has a different master. Very, very interesting. Okay, I need to give Gina her gift of the day. 
because I didn't do that. And then still need to give Zeki his gift of the day too. My gosh, running around like crazy. This doesn't have any particular archaeological archaeological significance, but it looks cool. Maybe I can use it to decorate the tent. Awesome, Gina. It's good to see you as always. So now I just gotta return to Zeki and uh, give him his gift. Well, you guys, I actually might finish off this episode here. Um, basically, what I wanted to do today was give a bunch of gifts and just kind of run around and talk to people, get my friendship levels up. In fact, let's actually look really quickly where we are at with everybody. So I need to get Ashura all the way up to four. And yeah, we have a whole new week. That's awesome. But yeah, so Ani's at two and a half, but Drew's at three everybody's like you know everybody's past one i think so that's really good and almost like a lot of people are halfway through two so that is amazing gina's up three kenyatta's kenley's almost at three which is kind of crazy to me uh reth is over three so so good oh we still have tamala at one okay all right that's fine and then i do want to do tish's quest but i'll probably uh, I need to get iron for the industrial set, so that's gonna have to come in due time. Probably gonna go on an iron run after this just to take my time with that, but yeah, anyways, guys, uh, that is gonna have to do it for this episode of Palea. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. Thank you for using my referral code and getting me these really cool, uh, this cool sweater and pants and hat and stuff. You guys are awesome. I hope you all have a very, very beautiful, wonderful day. And take care of yourselves and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.